Talk to us about today's practice. I thought today's practice went uh, well for the offense. Defensively, we got out to a slow start today, and we never really recovered. Uh, and I told the defense after practice, that's not Tennessee State defense. Uh, I was really proud of our offense, though, the, the way we came out and uh, was aggressive. We ran the football well, and my phone is ringing. So I'm going to hit the snooze button on this, and we're going to keep on doing this thing. But uh, <laughs> it went well. It went well offensively, defensively. We got to clean some things up. But, you know, we're missing a few guys on both sides of the ball. You know, this is the part of camp where, you know, you start to get banged up a little bit and you can easily start to feel sorry for yourself with some nicks and aches. But our, our guys are pushing through, and I'm real proud of them. How are you satisfied with the progress that the team has made so far? I think we've made tremendous progress. I really do. I, I think that um, the guys are taking coaching well. I think that, you know, from top to bottom, I think that we, we've improved in some areas. We've been able to look at some young guys and find out some young guys that can help our program, you know, this year. And that's what camp is all about. You know, you got a pretty good idea of what you already have coming back. The big thing is the new guys and cleaning up, you know, mistakes and whatnot. And I think we haven't made the same mistakes day in and day out. And you'd like to see progression in your team. And I think we, we've same progression in our team. Talk a little bit about the wide receivers. You know, we got some good wide outs. We got some big wide outs. You know, when you talk about Hakeem Parker, Quindell Cousins, Chris Sanders McCollum, Patrick Smith, you know, Andrew Bather, we got a good core wide outs. And I'm, I think that that group uh, could be a surprise to some people in the league and just around the nation, you know, in general. But, be, but our quarterback situation, they've been giving those guys the ball and they've been making plays down the field. And I'm really excited about that. Guys have been practicing, lifting weights, watching film. Soon classes will be added to that equation. How would that change things up for you guys? Uh, hopefully, you know, uh, we got kind of smart this year. Normally the first day of class is the worst day of practice uh, for every head coach in the country. But, you know, we'll actually be off that Monday, which is the first day of classes, I think the 24th, we'll be off that day, that's our off day. And hopefully, you know, when we return Tuesday, you know, it'll be a little smoother. But, uh, you know, you, you throw time management into the equation, you know, you throw everybody back on campus, it's a real college atmosphere now. And there's gonna be an adjustment, but our guys understand our mission, and I think that we'll do well. All right, thank you. Coach. All right, thank you, go Big Blue.